same time, the newly remodeled Acute Rehab Center at St. Mark's Hospital was unveiled today, and the event included a very special performance. This was so cool, Emily. Yes, Fox 13 News reporter Chris Arnold caught up with a former patient who credits the hospital with getting him back to what he loves, music. And it's a story you'll only see here on Fox 13. It's always different. For Scott Harris, it's always a challenge. The melodic notes from the saxophone, or the unique sound of the iwi, are part of his passion for music. Occasionally you really get to touch some with, someone with music. For 58 years, Harris says he's had some sort of instrument at his fingertips, getting to share the stage with a variety of different people. I'm not a regular member of the symphony, but I do play with them quite often. When I lived in Los Angeles, um, I was a, a member of the Burbank Symphony for many years. But things changed in October of 2021, when Harris says he got a concussion after his dog knocked him off his porch. His condition only got worse. I had the stroke itself. I believe I was already at the hospital. Scott came to us with a left lateral medullary stroke. He had right-sided weakness, uh, right-sided deficits in the upper and lower extremities, and he loves to play music. So for him, coming here was a pretty big life setback. For three weeks, Scott worked to get back on his feet at St. Mark's Acute Rehab Center. Although um, I still didn't have full mobility, I was able to, to function. Um, and still take care of the, the things I need to do in life at that point. As St. Mark's unveiled their newly remodeled Ark on Wednesday, there was Scott with his friend Dan, front and center, performing 30 minutes worth of music with plenty of applause and participation from the hospital staff that turned out. You get to see them doing what they love again. It's a pretty special moment that I know really reinforces why we chose to do this job. For Scott, just the whole atmosphere of being in music, it's, it's been my life. He was just happy to be performing and getting to share the experience with the healthcare workers who made it all possible. It's been 14 months and you know I haven't, haven't seen them in that time. And the, the fact that they recognized me when I came in, that, uh, that made me very happy. So what's next for Scott? Well, he tells me that he's working to record a film score right now with the Utah Symphony. He's really come so far. Scott is one of more than 3,300 patients helped here at the Ark since it opened back in 2012. Here in Mill Creek, Chris Arnold, Fox 13 News, Utah.